Okay, today I'm going to talk to you about the Gardner fuel filter, which I consider in one particular aspect to be a Gardner wart. There are very few Gardner warts, but this is one of them. But we've managed to get around it. Okay, here we have the filter. You're all very familiar with it. I think it looks really lovely. There's something um, female about it, I think. So, we're going to put in a new filter. We take it apart. We get our Gardner fuel filter box. Inside there's the filter element. We've got this seal. We have this tiny little small seal here, which fits on here on what I refer to as the nipple. Okay, so we simply pop the seal in there. Pop on the body, pop back on the boob, and tighten up with the nipple nut. Yeah, simple. But it's not. Because even with brand new filters, this, this wretched seal doesn't fit properly. Whenever you try to put it in there, look, you'll see. No matter how hard you try, it falls. And guess what? Whenever you tighten it up, it'll leak. Now, what we've done is, or what I've done in the past is, get a Stanley knife and trim a little piece off here, or a sharp pair of scissors, or your teeth, or whatever. Um, you have to trim this off before it'll fit properly. What I normally do is, I just go to my bench grinder, and I just run it around the bench grinder and grind off a little bit. And then it can be made to fit. But it's a pain in the neck. Why should I have to do this? So what I did was I went out and I did a bit of research and I located this. A very nice rubber um, is it nitrile, nitrile type ring. And it pops in there like that. You'll see that it fits without any folding or codology. Um, I then put on my, my boob as before. Tighten it up, it doesn't leak, it's fine. Now, I'm going to suggest that this has been a problem with Gardner filters for some time. Because if you look in the old parts book, they actually advertise a little bucket type contraption, which hangs down here on a piece of wire to catch the drips. So Gardner must have been aware of this for some time. Why didn't they fix it? Anyway, our solution works. Thank you so much.